G League trying to speed up the game a little bit, an experimental yes. rule. And even if it's a two-shot foul, you get one opportunity. Shot from downtown, and that's one of the ways that the Austin Spurs got back in that game the other night. Shot well from the three-point line, so good to see somebody out here ready to be aggressive and ready to knock it down. Scott in the corner answers back and responds with a three of his own. Trayvon Scott, the former ACC Defensive Player of the Year. Is a perfect example of that. Exactly. A lot of player movement, and that kind of affects whether or not you can win or lose late in the season as Book Knight hits from downtown. You know, at the end of the day, and, and they're in the trenches together, and it's great to see them support Well, each not other. to mention, you saw Keldon Johnson there. His, his brother Caleb is on this team, so he's an yeah. op opportunity to see his brother play. Book Knight, again with a takeaway. He's already got nine in the game, launches again. That was a heat check right there for Book Knight, but a rebound. And there's another takeaway. This is Theo Maladin. Take it to Book Knight for the slam. This is Kobe Simmons. We had been told he was not with the team, but apparently he didn't make the trip. It's just part of the game sometimes. Sometimes even good looks don't fall. Austin Spurs got to remain aggressive and, and keep shooting. Talk about a guy who's aggressive and keeps shooting. James Book Knight again. Former Arizona Wildcat. Dump into the post, Trayvon Scott. That was a tough shot. Catch on the cut to the basket. Our entire Valley Sports crew, glad to have you aboard here. We get a nice reverse layup there from Shondi Brown Jr. Remember, he had that big game. Is moving the ball better. They were struggling to move the ball in that first half, struggled to move the ball in the first quarter of this game. Let's see if they can pick it up. Oh, with a nice drive to the bucket, score the basket. Arguing his case. Nevertheless, it goes awry as Greensboro still has possession here as Hagens, the former Kentucky Wildcat, takes it in and scores. Working inside to Brown, tough shot, came up empty. Collision near half court, they're letting him play as Hagens takes it to the rim, elevates for the slam, Ashton Hagens. You see Book Knight back out there in that corner. He's Gotta just measuring the rim. Him. Book Knight launches again, buries another triple. Big time three, James Book Knight. Book Knight's having an incredible game, but even when he sat down, we saw plenty of guys are out here getting buckets. Randolph misses there. Back comes Book Knight. He checked three, got it. He's got 12. He's two of three from downtown. We talked about him having to be a little more aggressive on the scoring end. Short that time. We're less than a minute to go. And again, Austin Spurs keeping up the pace here, moving fast. Randolph. And attacking the rim. Jump stop in the lane, got that one to go. Coach deciding to go with some of those bench guys that had the hot hand. Book Knight taking all kinds of punishment on his way to the bucket, comes up empty in that shot. Now taking it to the rim, Johnson puts it in. Book Knight takes it inside, off balance shot, has it knocked away. Up ahead to Robinson, leaving it back for Johnson who lays it in. Bringing it back for Greensboro, up and under, that's Ooh. rejected. Champagne with a huge block, back the other way, Champagne to the rim, tie game. What a play by Champagne. Drive, kick, Randolph open in the corner, got it. Spurs back in front by one. Champagne. Ten on the shot clock. Aggressive move Ooh. inside, off the window and in. Sometimes we feel like you can do everything. Only after the full pump. <laughs> Champagne in transition, showing the full pump. Takes it inside for the lay in. Champagne looking for the drop pass for Hall, but he wasn't expecting it. Turns it over. Here's Sims on the drive, scores it, and the foul. But back come. The Spurs, a turnover, and it's another giveaway. This is Simmons. Up ahead to Sims. We've got a one-point game here in San Antonio as the Austin Spurs are, for one night only, occupying the AT&T Center. As Randolph hits the fall away. They're all over me right now. <laughs> and Shadi was all over it as was he was talking to the refs. <laughs> exactly. Randolph trying to float one up, looking for Brown. And it's a takeaway. Here comes Simmons on the break. Again, leaving it back for Sims. Simmons to Sims. Maladon, Booknight. Launches the three. Got another one. James Booknight from downtown. And Petar Moses says, this looks too much like the first quarter. 
the Austin Spurs opting to put some more size on Book Knight. Denzel Mahoney, one of our stronger defenders, smothering him in every Tray possession. Trayvon Scott making some moves down low. And it's crazy that he got still the majority of those points in the first half. Three-pointer in the corner, missed by Xavier Steen. Just been super aggressive this second half and showing why he's the leading scorer on this team. Left side, three-pointer. Champagne sets the screen for Hall. Mahoney takes it baseline, finds some room down that baseline and scores. Couldn't get it to go, it was off the back of the rim. Book Knight's got it. And here he comes, in transition. Book Knight through the lane, goes through the defenders. Timeout. We approach the one-minute mark. Hall works his way, bounce pass, inside! Shawnee Brown with the slam. Beautiful vision there. Rejected there by Whaley. Here comes Book Knight in transition to Sims to the rim, and he draws the foul. Looking to get it in. Can't find anybody. Finally does. And just going to have to let it fly. Delph, and it's going to be way off the mark, off the window high. And that's going to do it from here in San Antonio.